the stars on hand, uh, bandana wearing, John Cusack. Dustin Hoffman, a big Laker fan, an NBA fan on hand. Mariah Carey, who performed at the All-Star Game with Penny Marshall. And the Magic Man, Magic Johnson. Just above the three-point line. Thought he had made it, was falling away. Here comes Kobe out of the backcourt. Kobe now with seven rebounds. Kobe back past his shot behind his head. That got the Magic Man up out of his seat. Urban said, I remember that pass. Did I invent it? No, but I sure you do. What wonderful vision by Kobe through traffic. Last basket by Shaquille. You direct connect. I'll say the connection was there. And Kobe over the shoulder behind himself seemingly. He says, I see you, big fella. Just keep running. I'll get it to you. And get it to you. He did. And nice finish by number 34, Shaquille O'Neal. Shaq has got such great hands. I mean, Jermaine O'Neal, size 19s, so the Lakers will have it. A real nice hustle by Kobe again, coming down, saving it. Normally, saving it under the opposition's basket can be very dangerous. The Lakers did it twice and came away with the basketball. I like the Lakers' hustle tonight, especially from Devin George. Kobe attacking the basket, runs over a foster, lowered his shoulder, it will be called for the charge. Those and the Pacers have cut what was once a comfortable double-digit lead down to 67 58 5 remaining. Kobe with it, guarded by her test, goes left side, tough running jump. Oh, it rattled off the glass. I don't know if he called bank. Oh, no, with Indiana. Kobe trying to get in the lane, does so over. Oh, nice, beautiful make over Jermaine O'Neal and away from Ron Artest. And with that basket there, he goes to 10,000 career points, the youngest ever to get to 10,000 that fast. Congratulations, Kobe. There'll be a lot more records to come. That last basket that he gave Kobe the uh, 10,000 points now puts him atop the list of youngest to score that many. Bob McAdoo, Shaquille O'Neal, and a couple of others were 25 when they did it. Kobe, 24 years and what, 193 days? The announcement has just been made by longtime public address announcer Lawrence Tanner. The crowd rises as one to recognize the accomplishment of Kobe Bryant. Listen to this crowd. They, they can recognize talent when they see it. Crowd's still on their feet here at Staples Center. They may not sit down. Giving him his due. The props are justified, number eight. Because he has done it many times. Speaking of doing something many times, Kobe Bryant got to the 10,000-point mark. Boy, what a great accomplishment. The Lakers leading at 71 to 62. You're watching the world champion Lakers on Fox Sports Net. O'Neal now with 20, leading the Pacers. The Lakers on top. Kobe down the lane. Needs a bounce off the layup in traffic and has another one. That really improved his, uh, the way he rebounds. I mean, most of the time with two hands, that one, the one hand will right. Just inside a 6.20 remaining hand off to Kobe. Oh! Two-handed slam dunk on the weak side. Off the handoff from Shaquille. What a play. Well, you just never it ceases to amaze you with uh, the way he can create opportunities. Just cleared the rebound. Boy, Ron Artest, that shot was straight as can be. Got tapped on that. Hey, hey, hey. Jack's got 26 to lead the Lakers. Kobe's got 18. Garrett Fisher with 15. Kobe pull up jump up again from straightaway 18 feet. There's the play that I like the Lakers running in any kind of crunch situation. The play that has everybody buzzing was the basket. Handoff from Shaquille to Kobe, and you talk about spectacular. Wow. <laughs> then he shows his gymnastic <laughs> skills and does a backflip. <laughs> what can't he do? And I don't think there's anything that number eight can't do. I tell you, you give him a 10 for the dismount. That was perfect. <laughs> he gets a 10 on the shot, too. I like this. I really like this. Oh, look at that. You see where he took off, Stu? Up and under the backboard from the reverse side. The Lakers have six seconds. They can't. They didn't advance it because Rick Fox dribbled after the rebound before he called the timeout. You now have to really look to attack in a hurry because with the foul that the Pacers have to give, why well, push the Lakers? <laughs> Tough situation with six seconds. And Isaiah Thomas doing a good job of coaching, going to each and every player, reminding them that they had a foul of the game. Kobe coming out of the backcourt. Pulls up. That's a, that should count. Oh, that's a terrible call. They're waving it off, but that should count. That should count. That is a terrible call. Kobe knew that they had a foul to give as soon as he dribbled into the front court. 
He gathered himself, went in the air, and shot it. That is just a horrible call. I mean, this is continuation all the way. He stops, goes up, he gets grabbed. That is a basket. If they're going to re be able to look at the replays for the shots at the end of quarters, they better start looking at things that they mess up. Back to the Lakers' basket. Al Harrington moves off of Fox. That leave Fox wide open if he can get it back. Inside the shack, deflected away. Oh, he's got it. Quickly for the win. Lakers win it. There's Robert Ory again. You've got to learn. There's a, you talk about Reggie Miller having little time. Robert Ory is just 